Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the Albert Podcast. I am your host, Trey. And just like previous weeks before, we have a, a specialty guest and a, a specialty host. Our specialty host of today is Logan. It's your boy. Welcome, Logan, how's it, how's it feel to be in the big man seat again? In the big man seat? Mm-hmm. Feels like I never left. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> I'm in the big man seat. I edit this podcast. I can do whatever the fuck I want, and you're no one the... can really tell me what I know. So you're in the biggest man seat. Yeah, I am the editor. I control it all, bitch. And uh, uh, one of our normal guests, Drew. Yeah, this shit did. Come on, Drew. Yo, what's up? How you doing, Drew? Not much. Just got done masturbating. Semen came out. Uh-huh. We're good. Yeah. Drew's joining the Navy. Uh, yeah. Uh, Drew, if you are if you uh, start thinking of the trials and you start getting a little bit angry, you, we can talk about it. It's fine. Yep. <laughs> um, and then uh, our specialty guest and our final guest for this, this sweet little night is Josh. Fanboy Josh. Hello. You know, we found him on the streets again. And... Uh, yeah. What push came to shove, uh, Titus wasn't available. So we pushed and shoved uh, Josh into the van, and here he is. Yeah. Yep. How, how's it feel to be back in the uh, small boy chair, Josh? Uh, <laughs> uh, feels, feels good. I mean, at yeah. least I'm in a yeah. chair. I'm oh, just yeah. saying, Trey, uh, I just proved that I am also in a bigger chair than you are, even though you're the big host of this podcast. Is that what you think? Because Ace is in the biggest chair. <laughs> oh, is it a science reference or, bro? Chill. It's a sex reference. No, it. Oh, wait, do we never discuss that on the podcast? Guess there, what? There's a whole bit where Ace is like, "You, you fools think you lead your own things, but I rule everything." I'm like, "Yes, God King Narwhal." <laughs> oh, I, I don't even know about that one. I stay out of it. Oh, yeah. because uh, me and Titus yeah. were discussing things, and then Titus Asa was there because he's in the same room, and he hopped on the call and he said, "You know, you two can have fun discussing this all you want, but I'm just gonna let you two know that I am the ruler of everything here." <laughs> I was like, "Oh, damn it!" He's That's right. actually fair. <laughs> Not gonna lie. So, fun fact: Asa is now the COO. Um. Whoa, 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 whoa! No, he's not. That's me, buddy. No. <laughs> Honestly, there is no technical ahead of sale by. We're just kind of yeah. We can have shitty faces. democracy. We can we can have faces. We can have uh, editors. Laughing. What's that? Shitty democracy. I, I said we're idiots laughing and making jokes, and then like, exactly everything comes down to it. We're like, oh shit, who's going to tell us what to do? Exactly. <laughs> you know, I feel yeah. like there's all of us in general. Not even which you with... call Trey because he sounds like you know daddy. <sighs> All right. <laughs> That's the reason he's got all the chicks lining up at his door. Honestly. Sure, I... they're his mom and siblings, but you know. No, please. It's fine. <laughs> this is not Alabama or uh, West Virginia. Please, no. You know, earlier earlier today, I was just kind of sitting around, and I was like, oh, you've you know been what? sitting around all if day. I, if, if I, no, I haven't been sitting around all day. With, like, earlier today I was, but I've been doing some manual labor but um we just played trials that is pretty manual intensive not gonna lie that was later on in the day earlier in the day it was you know her no um but i was just kind of sitting around i was like you know what this shit ain't worth it if i ever get rich i'm just gonna be a playboy and call it a day (laughs) dude well actually you'd be a playboy to get rich Ooh. yeah it's, fair. it's not how it works, Drew. Totally. Totally how it works. Totally. Totally. We should start a show called Life Advice with Drew. We should. Advice to ruin your life. You know, speaking of uh, starting shows, I like how we're at the point where we're just spinning out ideas now. <laughs> yeah. We like, reached a good point. Logan, you want, you want to talk about the thing that you're planning? <laughs> Do I? No, no. Sure, why not, actually? Yeah, go ahead. 
Um, so I am starting a debate show. That's right, everyone. I'm gonna have some guests on, different depending on the subject, you know. Mm. So if I'm doing Destiny, I'm not gonna bring uh, Titus on who doesn't play Destiny. You know, I'm gonna match the ghost guest to the subject, but uh, we're gonna de- have a small little debate. Yeah, I'm going to bring in clips and shit to back everyone's arguments and shit up. It's gonna be pretty great. Yeah. The, it's going to be a little bit higher production than our normal stuff, which is yeah. already top tier production quality. Are you kidding me? Of course. Have you seen that montage? Yeah, that was. Yeah. That yeah. that had time put into it. Me and Drew. Was... <laughs> I actually was listening to last week's podcast at like um 3 a.m. Yeah. I just kept on hearing Drew and I kept on waking up. <laughs> I had to turn it off. <laughs> Uh, last week's was really fucking funny dude yeah. if you haven't listened to last week's podcast what are you doing Honestly, why are you listening to this one go okay. back yeah go back and then watch this one again but then like yeah. skip some like the middle podcasts we've done because some of them aren't that funny but then go to like back to the first one that we saw the fucking ambitions at the first one bro the first one we came out fucking hard but i always come out hard I know that's a lie. <laughs> Are you saying I have ER or ED? No, I talked to Crystal and she she confirmed you ain't got much game. Ooh, damn it! I'm gonna text Crystal and Chrysler. No, she she's okay with it. Okay. Oh, but I still like this Chrysler. I don't. <laughs> I don't no, we're gonna call her by her name, Crystal, 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 since we can say it now. Uh, I, I don't uh, have to bleep. <laughs> oh, speaking of bleeps, I got an actual bleep now. So do you? Yeah. So you're gonna fucking irate people, whenever. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you read. I also like Ace's redacted. Ace's yeah. redacted is pretty funny. I like my no, 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 senpai. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I have an audio clip of that saved. It's good. Yeah. So wait, if we curse, you're gonna bleep it out? No, no, no. We do that whenever we get monetized. But we right mostly now, it's say just like, names it's like, and that sort of shit. We kind uh, of bleep okay. it out if people who aren't, you know, necessarily yeah. okay with being on the podcast. Yeah, names. Generally, people we haven't actually talked to about it. Yeah. So like name specific locations, stuff like that. Yeah. 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 Like a name, like no, 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 senpai. God, Logan, go. bleep it out. <laughs> but we don't actually know someone oh wait yeah we do that's one of oh, Josh's sisters bleep all, bleep yeah bleep, bleep that out come on little damn man. god damn it extra work so Josh how does it feel to have a a, a, a sibling name no 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 senpai <laughs> boy why you gotta do tra- <laughs> Logan like that <laughs> son of a bitch bro, bro there's so, already a lot on my play we recorded three fucking let's plays last oh, night yeah, yeah that's right can, I, know. Uh, I can edit this podcast if needed i can say right now how living with my sister i just a pain in the ass yeah josh yeah. you've got enough siblings that you could just say living is a pain in the ass so you know yeah. back in like the renaissance period whenever like everybody had like 15 kids that's just josh he lives in the renaissance actually pretty yes. much i've been in that house it's fucking crazy i had a I've five-year-old been challenging me to a death fight like the was... second the second time you came in my house drew asked me a question how are you have you not killed everyone in this house i said I almost have. What was it? Um, once I went into his, um, I was on like a call with Josh. His little brother walked in, and I told Josh to tell his little brother hide. But the brother thought I said hi, and then I and then Josh said no hide, and then I sent the little brother a picture of all my guns and weapons. Oh, you know. I've only been for, for reference. For reference, most of them were airsoft. All of them actually were very no. soft. No, there was a couple of katanas in there, knives that are actually sharp, and you know. That's yeah, they're made out of yeah. airsoft. Though. They're yeah. made out of airsoft. Obviously. Yeah. yeah. Obviously. But my BB, but my airsoft sniper does kill. But Drew, this is in D and D, of course. In D and D, of course. In D and D, of course. Um, of course. 
but I've only been to Josh's house once, actually. It was just on the front lawn, and I was, like, something else that day. So whenever Josh came out, that was, it was my first time meeting Josh in person. He, like, yeah, walked he... and I said, you there, get in the car, and I just walked yeah. back. <laughs> yeah because of quarantine and shit one day trey was like hey let's play some D D. you know anybody good and i was like i mean i got my buddy josh we could have josh yeah like, who josh i'm like oh, yeah. his friend and you know we hit him up they meet each other and the two of them liked each other like you know they were like oh yeah this guy's cool you know as yeah. far as you know and so for my graduation party you know that was their first time meeting in person mm-hmm and of course, this is on a day that Trey pulled an all-nighter, so he's fucking raw as hell. So, I sometimes like before like parties or before like a big event, I like to just like flip the coin, do a fifty-fifty, to where if I do an all-nighter and just stay up all night, I'll either be like really tired and just shut down for an entire day, and I'll be raw as in the sense of I'll just be in the corner, just like looking depressed, or. I will just be absolutely like off the walls, fucking bad shit crazy. <laughs> yeah. And he was the second one that day. Like, the f- what was it? The- what did you do? You like walked up and said, You're coming with me, bitch, or something like that. You know, all, all of his siblings, all of his siblings were like sitting out on like the front yeah. lawn. And, and the like, young ready. ones, mind you, the young yeah. ones. And so, like, I heard like stories about them, so as soon as I got out of the car, they all looked at me and I looked around and I was like and I said, Where is he? And they all like just pointed inside and I saw Josh and I'm like, You there come <laughs> with me, bitch. And I pointed back at the car and I walked back and I got back inside. Oh god. And then you beautiful. made a then you made a gay joke about getting <laughs> in the car. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> he did. What did I do? You did. You, you sat. You sat down in the front seat, the shotgun position, and you were like, "Get in! Come on, get in! Let's get in, Josh!" <laughs> like you wanted me to sit on your lap, and I was like, "Oh hell no!" No, I think I think it's just because you're like standing there, like talking to somebody. He's like, "Hey, Josh," and you're like, "What?" I said, "Get in, buddy! Come on, <laughs> hop on in." The water is warm. The water's wet. <laughs> that's not all. That's gonna be wet. You know, Josh, I have a saying. I have a saying. Yeah, I don't care if you're straight. We're all like spaghetti. We we're no longer straight as soon as we get wet. Bro. <laughs> Boy You're no longer straight as soon as you start to think about oh. getting wet. So if I get cancelled with the same shit that James Charles got cancelled for, I'm just gonna say I'm going out with the bang. <laughs> Bro. Quite literally. Drew, you're invited. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no. This is good. I'm enjoying this. Bro. <laughs> We're not even that. like, what are we, five minutes in? And God. This is like 13 minutes. This is, <laughs> this is 13 minutes? Holy shit. And yeah. D&D, yeah. D&D, of course. God damn it. Oh, uh, okay. and to give awesome. some context on that joke, there's a <laughs> no, thing no. going on in uh, a game we play called Destiny. You've probably heard of it. Yeah, Destiny. And it's double loot. Yeah. So we were kind of bitches. It's a three man event. So uh, yeah. me, Andrew, and yeah, Trey we were, we were, doing night were farming it in the background while playing D&D. Yeah, and that's like a big no-no rule that uh, it's the game that Asa runs, and mm-hmm. uh, if you like play video games or anything, do anything else other than D and D and breathing, um, he'll get annoyed, and I get annoyed too. But today I was just like, Fuck it. "There's double loot." I'm sorry, Asa, and so we try to hide yeah. it for so long. But then Logan was like, "God damn it, I fell off the cliff," and like I was like, "I gotta save this. How do I save this?" And I said, "In D and D, of course." <laughs> And then Ace obviously, like, and then Ace was didn't like, work. <laughs> yeah, we Cause try because we're just standing in a fucking room in the game, and then Logan and Destiny just falls off. And like this happened in D and D, of course. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Beautiful day to play Destiny. Yeah, it was funny. Yes. Yeah. And How this is... event will be over by the time you uh, hear this episode? So, haha, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> What was that? Yeah. Probably missed out. 
how is that? I haven't played Destiny in a while, so how is the double loot going? Is it good? Oh, it is, is it... beautiful. Dude, I got Trey two. Somehow yeah. Got Stompies and Dragon Shadow in the in same the same, room. yeah. Dang. They both got really good stats. Yeah. He got God tier stat drops on both. Yeah. I mean, of course. I even say this out loud. Yeah, in D&D, of course, though. Yeah, in D&D. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Of course. So, Ace, if you're watching this, we're all doing this during D&D. Yeah. Yeah, no, it was in D&D. It wasn't in Destiny, it was in D&D. You see me, Asa? I got my dice. Oh, I'm rolling the Constitution saving throw. Got a 12. Oh, my dice that are turn- across the room. That turns into a 30 because I play a monk. <laughs> <laughs> now oh, you're using your brain. I'm, I'm a high-level monk? What? Oh, you want me to do saving throw? Good thing I'm a profession in that. <laughs> Yeah, um, I'm proficient in basically every saving throw because I'm a paladin. Right. So am I. This will be out by yeah. the time that this podcast comes out. Uh-huh. How do you feel about me kicking your ass in the Crunker tourney? Uh, uh, I don't want to answer. <laughs> it, it was fucking. I was so sad because I was like, yeah. oh hell yeah, I get to fucking. Because I was like, I can do all right. I'm probably gonna get like. You know, some kills, and then there's going to be one round where I might, you know, just barely win. But no, Drew I mean, just fucking floored me, because I haven't played Crunker since, like, the last time we recorded it. So I was like, I mean, oh. You, you, you did get some kills. I did, you know what? And those kills I'm were... I'm not going to say why you got those kills, but you got some kills. <laughs> <laughs> you know? I was doing stupid shit. Like, um, my mouse, I can adjust the sensitivity on the fly. So at some point, I, like, um, adjusted it to max sense uh-huh. and stuff. And tried to, like, shoot Trey, but I was just, like, flicking so far down. <laughs> stuff. You know? Dude. It looked like I was looking at his penis. I'm going to go... Right. Yeah. Look at this to see if this is actually the case or not, or if Drew just got killed occasionally and doesn't want to admit no, no, no. it was. There was a time or two that he got me almost dead, and then um, what is it? He got me almost dead. I um, like he spawned right in front of me and just went bop bop bop, and I went ah. No, that's incorrect. I went no. Yeah, no, he went bop 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 bop. Oh shit, you guys just reminded me, uh, someone texted me and, uh, reminded me to send Kylan all the sounds. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, you gotta send me those too. But you can send them in a big file, I'll cut them. Yeah. Cut I texted Kylan the other day and was like, hey, when I send these to you, can I just make one big audio clip and then you can cut them apart, you know? It'll save me time and it shouldn't take him too long, right? Mm. And he was like, no, fuck you, it would be a waste of my time to do that. Damn. Send what? one at a time. I have to Damn. send them one at a time. I, I almost popped off. It's a waste of my time to send them to you one at a time, bitch. Like, Since we lost our our favorite editor, um, yeah. Josh. We yeah, lost editor, editor Josh. Josh as and an D&D, editor. of course. Yeah. Um, Logan's taking over the Let's Plays. And so eventually I'm going to be taking over the podcast. Mm. So yeah. I need these. You? You? Yep. Even I'm though, not gonna miss editing Kate Ace's cup out. You guys didn't hear, it, but Ace's cup <laughs> is the bane of my uh, fucking existence. Every, and what every, was single, it? every single time I had Ace on the podcast, I just had like a little like notepad next to me, and I was just tallying every single time. And I fucking bro. I had to mute myself sometimes from fucking laughing at the number that we got. Bro, me. once I sent Trey just an audio clip of like what was it, like, 10 consecutive seconds of Smack Smack and some other shit. It was crazy. Yeah. No, no, at some point, I hear, like, I was... this. And then I hear, a, <laughs> like, three seconds later, I'm like, God damn it. It's oh. so good. Yeah. It, it's uh-huh. annoying as fuck, because I try and cut all that it? out, because I don't like ear rate podcasts that have shit like that. Like, that shit needs to go. Yeah, yeah. And, gonna, and like Logan has gone to the point where he'll notice this in like professional grade, but like the Rooster Teeth podcast, he realizes like whenever there's like a, the slightest scrape well, against the mic and he fucking it freaks. stresses me out. Like, I'll be listening to one of those podcasts, I'm like, why didn't you edit that out? Like, especially when it clogs the other person out, like, you can't hear what the fuck they just said because someone scraped some shit in the background. Logan, they do it live. Like, 
yeah, and they also do light editing, so like, it, it, I'd be cool if like you went through and just, you know, cut out that one person's audio for a minute or two, so that way you could still hear them, but like, when they're talking and you can't hear them because someone's got a truck in their fucking background, what the hell? <laughs> like, oh, no! Dude. Are you talking about the uh, the new ones where they're doing the at home? Yeah, like, it's understandable uh, why they have to do them at home, but like, what the fuck, man? I thought I thought you were talking about like whenever they're all like, at, you no. know, just on the set and like they script on them, stage. Like, it's actually not that bad usually. Like usually it's like you know, click here or there, but it's not mm-hmm. bad. Like yeah, it doesn't need to be cut out. But like at home. I've heard trucks in the background that clog out the mic. You hear constant taps and shit. You hear SOs in the back, you know, significant others, kids, like, and they that's drive why, insane. And that's why we record this the All Aboard podcast at 5 in the morning. That's right. Isn't that right, Josh? Yep. In D&D, of course. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, I, I have a question. It's 5 a.m. in D&D. In actuality, it's like 10.50. <laughs> so what was that, Josh? So I have a question, and Drew Drew knows this because I've told him a couple times. Mm-hmm. Um, you think I pay attention? D&D, D- <laughs> D&D character building. Yeah, what about it? I w- I've been trying to find a perfect character yeah. at, at base level, level one. Base hey, Josh. Level. Josh. Right. Do- yeah, One you know, now you are far from discovering this because Logan, I look at the way that you make things. Gone. There's <laughs> a simple answer to this question, and Dude. it is, and I quote, Paladin. <laughs> <laughs> but do do you guys believe there is a perfect character out there? Paladin. Uh, wait, hold on. What do you mean by perfect? Do you mean like perfect to like at doing a bunch of damage? Perfect for role player? Do you mean like perfect Paladin. for everything? The, the most Paladin. even stats possible. For like, everything, so like the most busted stats possible. Yes, but at magic, base okay. level. Without now, magic I will explain my without magic. magic items. Just you know what? Yeah. No, 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 no. Let's save this debate for debate it. And Josh, you'll get your answer there. Eh? I can't wait for this to never happen. Constantly DMing me, asking me. I'm like, bro. You know what? No, that's fine. Let's talk about it right now. So, paladin. <laughs> Paladin, okay. The answer yeah. is Paladin. Paladin so, uh, has this thing called Divine Smite, alright? They also mm. have spells, but fuck that shit, you don't need it. Don't Divine Smite. You take your spell slots, and you get two extra D8s of damage at base level. Yeah. For every higher level than first, it's another D8. If you're fighting demons, that's also another D8. So, just you get, perfect. Wait, you so also wait. get health points just sitting in your pocket that you can give to anyone and everyone at mm. any point. So five per level. Basically, the gist of it is is that even at level one, you can do an attack and it can do multiple D eights at level one. Okay. No, you don't get divine smite till level three. I, no, level two. Uh, Again, level I'm not. One, then, I, I I understand you get another this. useful ability, and it's um that you get through all of paladin, and uh, you can just detect good and evil five times a day because you feel like it. Yeah. Right, so yeah. Again, I. That's great about the strength and attack and healing, but I'm looking. I'm not looking for too much strength or too much. Of that. I'm looking for the most even possible. Yeah, the and they also are, on, get to add right? their charisma modifier to all on, their saving throws. Josh, are you so they have min-maxing? really good. Huh? Are you, are you talking about min maxing? What do you mean by that? Okay, so min maxing is is that all the shit like let's say you're playing a fighter. You're gonna want a lot of constitution, a lot of strength, or dexterity, right? Constitution, yeah. strength slash dexterity. Min maxing is is that you do the minimal and everything, and then the max and all the things that you need. To where, mm-hmm. let's say, uh, you're pure fighter. maxing go paladin. Yeah, let's say you're going for a fighter, and to where they can do all this like bunch of damage just in one turn and then they can suck up all these like attacks but if they need to like re- use like any intelligence or like use charisma they were absolutely terrible at it that's mm-hmm. right. okay yeah yeah paladin is honestly probably the best uh class in my opinion as i have stated oh my god um because it gets to add, basically, you have to max out charisma 
but then you won't feel any saving throws really because if uh, I've got like plus five charisma on my main character, yeah, and I get to add plus five to all my saving throws, and so yes. I've got a saving throw that's like plus thirteen, you know, several like that. Yeah, you know, and I only have one negative stat, and uh, I went ahead and took this feat that allowed me to add my proficiency bonus to it, so it is muy perfecto. Like there's Guys, no problem. Yes, we know. No, no, no. Um, this is very stupid. So, I was closing out apps on my computer to make the podcast run better. Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. And um, so I'm over here clicking things, you know, turning off, and I was like, oh, Discord, I can do that. You know, turn that off. And I was like, wait a second, I don't hear anybody. <laughs> Launch Discord. All right, five head. Oh that thing my again. god. I was like, I'm an idiot. What a fucking move, dude. Technical difficulties. <laughs> oh, actually, I can close out my Discord, and uh, if I'm in a no, call, it will I stay in quit. the call. If you hit quit, it will. <laughs> it's so good, dude. Bro. <laughs> Bro. Yeah. Fuck you, Drew. Wow. Namaste, Drew. Wow. Oh my god, dude. God. Namaste. Well, I've been curious. <laughs> Josh. Is yeah. your PFP Ichigo? Yes. Oh my god. Yes. Yes, it is. That is probably one of the best anime characters, in my opinion. Yeah. Oh yeah, my favorite anime character is? We if don't care. Someone from JoJo's. Fucking really Drew over here closing a fucking Discord. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'm not an anime character. Uh, you are now. No, 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 no. I'm not an anime character. I say you are, so you are. Bam. No, no, no. No. I'm an anime hero, you bitch. Oh. oh Thank you. Shit. Thank you. Ooh. I'm an anime villain, so suck it. I really Honestly, have... I'd, much, I'd much rather be the villain. I don't even care if I lose. They do way cooler shit. Take that how you will. Bro, don't make incest jokes. No. All right. But, like, uh, fucking... No. I feel like... Uh, Dio, or uh, what? What was the name from a? Uh, Didn't Chrysalin ask if Dio yeah, or if you love Dio more than her? All right, so we're we're cutting that out. Um, that is uh not not gonna be there. We've already um, been over this. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Logan, I request. It's my you. choice, not Logan's personal affairs. Wait, I'm messing something here. What's going on that I'm missing? You're Logan. missing absolutely nothing. Okay. No, 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 no. So, I heard something about Chrislin. No, I don't know what. Not. Yes, yes, yes. Chrislin once asked Trey. All right, so Logan has been evicted from the uh, <laughs> premises. Uh, we're going to talk about his editing position. Um, well, he's, he's already lost his audio editing position because I'm stealing that. Oh, oh my gosh. As I was saying, his Logan girlfriend been... asked. No. Okay, Logan has been escorted back in again. As I said, his <laughs> girlfriend asked if he loved Dio more than her. I would have said yes. <laughs> Fuck, Logan has so much power, he over he overturned the security. He's now back in the recording booth. Uh, yes. <laughs> Those God. black market hi me. Oh uh, God. I'm so scared right now. I've lost all my power. I'm coming for you, bitch. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill you, okay? He I'm gonna has a girlfriend. Please, sir. I have a family. You know, no, no I, please, sir. I have a girlfriend. I, I, uh, I look forward to the day whenever uh, Titus and I, if Titus is even still co-hosting, but uh, Titus and I, we eventually just get bored and we say, ah, oh, screw it. We just change the podcast where we're no longer the host, but we're just guests that are there every time just to see what happens. Because, <laughs> like, the time that Logan... Is, but that's kind of what it is. Whatever Logan and Drew fucking um, host of the Shipwreck podcast, me and Titus just got to fucking go and let it all out. Yeah, we gotta record that again soon. We do, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, I was going to ask if you want to be on it, Trey. I wasn't. I I would assume that it would be on it. Oh, wait, no. I, I, thought gonna, I thought you were going to get a Benny. 
we decided we're going to do Bennett Spencer, and we're going to do five since it's an hour and a half long podcast. We're doing an hour and a half, dude. Dude, yeah. we're not going to be able to talk about enough shit. We're, we're there will living... be five of us. We we're... wanted to continue that one day we had five. Trust me. It'll work. We fucking we're even limiting this to forty minutes. Hey, fun fact: the Albert podcast now being limited to forty minutes. What? I thought it was forty-five. No, it's forty. Why are we? Question: Why? I just do I do forty-five, so it's even. We're well, like, we're feeling we feel like with COVID and shit, you know, there's not a whole lot for us to do, so we don't have awesome stories of us going out and fucking killing three hundred people. Also, because you know, if we did that, we'd get the corona. Yeah, we don't want that. We, we don't want that code. You know, yeah. our lives aren't as interesting right now. Yeah. Okay. That makes, uh, that makes some sense. Yeah. Yeah. So, because if you notice around the last 15 minutes of it, it's kind of us bumbling, going, uh, what the fuck are we going to talk I about have now? There's so many stories about yeah. me kicking kids' asses around, um, what is it? Whenever I was younger. I, I have a story that was pretty recent before, like, COVID. Uh huh. Well, go um, on. And stuff, yeah. Um, so basically, I was taking a ride on my bike, you know, working out like I usually do. And I came across this kid who um, thought he would, like, he was a really cool guy, thought he could be tough. And he ended up wanting to fight, knife fight me. And I was just like, uh, was kid. No, oh, wait, 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 Drew, are you telling us to the time we got sent to prison, you had a shank fight with somebody? No, no, this is a different time. Okay. Yeah. No, um, anyways, basically this kid wanted to get in a knife fight, which I was like, no, man, please, please I just want to walk away mm. and stuff. And this kid just kept on, like, picking, trying to pick a fight. And I was like, no, man, I don't want to fight you. He's like, he just kept on trying. Oh. And so eventually he just got annoyed and threw, like, a stab at me. And let's just say I broke the kid's wrist and then the knife looked worse. You yeah. know, Drew, I'll, the only thing that I can really think about whenever you're telling this is that why didn't you just go for the Asa technique? What? <laughs> you know what I'm talking Sit about. Sit on him. Fucking <laughs> Asa got in a fight with the guy one time, but Bro. Asa was just not having it, so he just, like, flopped over on top of the guy. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> here's, here's wasn't the that picture. one kid? That fucking... You know which kid I'm talking about, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. now I was talking to Drew. Yeah, I know who you're talking about. No, it was not that yeah, kid. Yeah, okay. No? Oh, wow. Yep. Dude, but, uh, so the kids in our neighborhood would be crazy, because, like, one day I was dragging this kid along, I was forced to take him on a bike ride with me, so that yeah. sucked. But he was fucking slow compared to me. Like, you know, I'll work out, and I was like, I was zooming on my bike. So I stopped and was waiting for him to catch up, and these two kids are just walking on the sidewalk, and one of them just freezes in their track when they see me, you know, all masculine, standing there, okay, just sitting like there. It. It was that kid. And he like freaks out and just stares at me and I kind of cock an eyebrow. This one literally looks at his friend and goes, should I pull out my knife? Ooh. And I just kind of looked at him again, cocked my eyebrow even higher, shrugged and drove off. Drove oh, off in his bike. Indeed, of yeah. course. Indeed, yeah. of course. Yeah. yeah. And as I was driving off, I heard one of the kids go, I think that should, yeah, I think you should have done that. Oh, fuck. I'm like, how old are these kids? They were like, they looked to be 11 and 12. Was Holy like, shit. Like, bro. <laughs> bro, you should join a gang. You're Why hardcore. They, they're threatening you. Why were they threatening you? I guess it's because you were like, because Logan, I will. They started you. staring at me. I looked back at them. No, you no, know, no, they're no. still staring at me. So I cocked an eyebrow. They... Logan, I think it's a, I think it's just because you have a confident like stance and they, they. Yeah, they I was were... sitting on a bike, bro. I don't know. There was there was no cockiness to it. I I think they were just like they just felt like messing. I with probably bed. look was irritated because awesome. the kid I had with me was a an idiot Damn. and b an idiot. Oh, I didn't know you're taking Drew. You know, you know what? If you're listening to this, that kid, fuck you. <laughs> I know you're like eight years old, but fuck you. You're a piece of shit. I still Boy. believe this. Bullying a fourteen-year-old. No, no, no. He's eight. Oh. Yeah, that kid almost got me killed. I fucking hate that kid. By the way, uh, when will the uh, Among Us shit be released? Spoiler: no, I wasn't planning on putting that out for another four months. God. Four months. Yeah. Four months. 
No, are you serious? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I was about to say, like, holy shit. Um, if I can actually get time to edit, if Drew, especially if Drew can edit this, uh, yeah, hopefully edit the first this. one will be coming out Friday. Friday. And it'll come out on coming Fridays. Like this Friday? This Friday, okay. next Friday, and the Friday after. Oh, we decide hey, that the along with attorneys. the attorney. Attorneys yeah, will just... be on Monday. Yeah. Hey, uh, if if you if everybody here watching feel like Among Us, stay tuned for Friday. Yes, sir. And if you're not listening or watching, then do. I would appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. To the people actually never gonna hear this. Listen to our podcast. Yeah, no, if you're never going to hear my voice or Logan's <laughs> or uh, Josh's or Drew's, you're never going to hear voices, but just so you know, you should watch. Yes. And D&D, of course, and D&D. Okay, so God damn it, Trey. My mom decided to get me and Logan a counselor for some reason, right? So we're like, whatever. But um, Logan ended up telling him about, the, like, Sailbite and having him, you know, listen to it. His, the first episode he turns on actually has Fanboy in it. Yeah. And stuff. And he hears your voice, Trey, and he's like, holy hell, that kid's got a deep voice. I wonder how old he is. And then you say you're 53. <laughs> uh, oh, no, and he was like, oh, whatever. He's like, oh, this this kid is only 16. Spoilers. Logan, like, oh, Logan, bleep it out. It's me who's editing the podcast. Drew, bleep it out. I, I won't. Drew. Again, personal matters, Drew. You have to, you fool. <laughs> hey, Trey. Yo, it's up, it's me. I thought you said you wouldn't be able to take over until next week, Drew. No, I said I can take over this week. You said oh, okay. you're 55, right? No, I'm 56. Then why are you dating a, a um, you no, know, no, minor? No, why are you no. dating a minor? <laughs> you live in Oklahoma. It is 16 and up. Oh, actually, oh whoa, whoa, whoa. That. bleep that out, Drew. Yeah. Yeah, editor, we, editor no, Drew. No, later no, on, we, bleep that out, please. No, we, we've said that we lived in Oklahoma before. In no, we haven't. No, we haven't. No, we uh, haven't. I don't remember that out. being yeah, said ever. Single time. We have. We have. No, we have. Trust me. I'm the editor. I, I listened to this four times. Okay. okay. I listened to every single podcast. Really? I'm just times. saying that's technically confidential yeah. for information. At, at, at this at this point, um, here my yeah. number is. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Bleep that out. That's an area code. Bleep it out. It's an area code it for us. I know it is. Drew, oh, yeah, yeah. I... I will. Drew, bleep out every single time you talk. Damn. <laughs> that would actually sound pretty interesting. I think that was a bit from a uh, from a crunk. You know what? I'm bored. Like... If you want to call me, call 248-434-5508. Damn yeah. it, not this again. We don't even do this, Logan. <laughs> but, um... What was it? Uh, It was a Crunker video where, like, Drew kept on, like, trying so hard to, like, try and join, but he kept on getting disconnected. It was either me or Titus. We're like, you know what, Editor Josh, every single time Drew talks, just bleep him out. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, Seriously, yeah. Over here. There's gonna be and no he change. didn't do it. I know he didn't do it, and I'm so mad at him. I'm so That's happy that he fired. left me Bro. in. That's why I got fired. <laughs> Yeah. Damn. Bro. After watching that Hey Editor Josh video, I realized we probably said Hey Editor Josh in that video about a hundred times. No, he left a counter up. He no, left a counter he, of all the times. Out. Yeah. He cut that out was said so much in the video. No, it's just I wanna I wanna paint myself in a better light. I did not force him into that much slave labor. <laughs> <laughs> He got he, he fucking he got amped up in the in the Among Us footage. He was like, "I'm gonna say hey, Elder Logan, fifty times." And I was like, "Oh shit, he is, isn't he?" What he didn't realize was, uh, we're playing comms off game, buddy. <laughs> I don't think I've met Editor Josh even over a voice call. No, no you have not. I don't think I have. Damn. Yeah, no. He's a cool guy. Content boys, that's content. The first time that Trey and editor or editor Josh and Josh meet. The fanboy and the editor will collide into one being. Well, he's no longer the editor, so what so are we gonna call him now? He's just Josh. Ex editor. Ex editor Josh. No. Ex editor. Ex editor. No, nope, that's what he is now. Ex editor Josh. 
You're gonna miss calling him Editor Josh. I wrote a song about Editor Josh. It's so sad. Immediately. Hey, you wanna sing it right now? Yeah, sure. Let's hear it. Here, just give me a moment of silence. Mm-hmm. This will be the. Okay, thank you. I'll um put it in later. Act like you were surprised. <laughs> oh. oh, that was pretty good. Like, yeah, oh, thank yeah. you. Thank was, you. I worked hard. That's actually really nice. That's crazy. It's almost like you cut in your beautiful singing into the audio. Yeah. yeah. It's not yeah, like I was, was going like, to try it first try. That, that was like you. This is like you tried it like five times before you finally put it in. That's crazy. Oh my god! So well. Sounded yeah. so crisp, clean. That sounded pretty crispy, dude. Like, the re- only you... reason that I'm not singing it right now is because it's um. No, night. what do you mean? You just said it. Where we're at. And, um, yeah, there's people in my house. <laughs> oh. Do we need to call the cops? <laughs> what? What? Yeah, I'm in his house. Yeah, fuck. Oh, we really do need to call the cops. Hold on. He's trapped here with me. I'm dialing 911. 555. 55. All right. And with that uh, beautiful rendition of Hey Editor Josh, if we even put it in, Drew, I, bl- I trust that you will. Well, um, We're going to end that for now. What? Um, Thank you everyone for coming here logan thank you for being uh my specialty co-host i always am baby always am drew thank you for arriving thank you trey and uh thank you special guest josh for uh letting us put you in a body bag again and bring you into the studio no yeah. problem it was my pleasure i never um, question what, what do you work at chick-fil-a when i when i drag you up the cement steps in the body bag is your face usually down or up do i need to be more gentle should I take the elevator? Because, by the way, there's an elevator I could take. I just thought the stairs were more yeah. convenient. Yeah, yeah. We, we and it helped with my cardio. So it's the, it's the front of my face that's getting hit, and the elevator would be nice. Damn, I, my cardio is going to go down. It's also an extra electric bill. I, Josh, I don't know if we're going to be able to cut that in. I'm sorry, boy. Yeah. Oops. Yeah, my, okay. my cardio. I understand. Josh, this, next time I'll bring you in, in a hammock. This ass has to be in good shape, so I'm sorry. The cardio loss isn't worth it. But, um, thank anyway, you. All. Thank you thank for you. watching. Yeah. Uh, if, if, you, <laughs> if you're uh, listening to us on SoundCloud, if we even. Yeah, I'm sure we'll still upload there. Uh, uh, I checked, and Titus has not been uploading to SoundCloud. Unbelievable. Dumbass not doing Titus, that. Titus also has not updated the website. Unbelievable. I've reminded him every week. You know, I haven't what? checked the website out actually. I'm gonna I'm gonna Josh. Stick there's with a sexy the picture of me. I'm gonna Josh. Stick, shut up. I'm gonna stick with the outro. If you're listening to this on motherfucking SoundCloud, then you you better be listening on SoundCloud. Um Yep. Thank you for listening. Follow us. Leave a like and comment what you Q-J want. Cue guitar. Yeah, get that in here. And then YouTube. If you're watching this on YouTube, which you better be also, give us all our views that we need. Um, leave a like. Subscribe. Ring the notification bell so you can watch our shit. We do gameplays. Uh, we do the podcast. We're planning on doing other shit. Um, watch the other episodes of the podcast. This has been number 11, baby. Yeah, and... Uh, and- Give me a hundred subscribers. We're still doing a rap battle. Yeah, Titus and Drew are doing a rap battle. hundred subscribers. Yep. And uh, thank you for watching. And goodbye. Mm-hmm.